Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So round one of the Falcon and Red Guardian arena is over. I didn't go for either of those champions. I already have them, so there was no need. But uh, if you didn't go for them and you don't have them, they're good champions to pick up. Uh, if I didn't already have them, I would. Uh, Falcon just recently got a uh, buff, and he's much better than he was before. Still not going to be uh, the champion that you want to use all the time, but, you know, he is worth having now, I would say. Um, he has uh, some good utility. So, without further ado, let's go to the leaderboards here. As you can see, I got the 5,000 five-star shards. That's what I went for. Uh, that's what I always go for if I'm not going for the champion. All right, and the rest will be milestones. So sometimes I might put up a little bit too much in one arena and accidentally get the champion, but not this time. All right, we're going to ignore the three-star arena uh, because due to a recent uh, update, you get the three-star featured champion anytime you hit the top milestone in any of the featured arenas. So there's no reason to look at that leaderboard anymore, really. All right, so let's start with the four-star basic, which is Red Guardian. And we're going to see if anyone that we know is on this leaderboard that did not have a four-star Red Guardian and wanted one. I went for him when he was the featured four-star, and I actually took him up to rank five. I now have a five-star version and I don't regret taking the four star up because uh, four stars help me out in the arena. And it also will be nice when, and I say when, because I know they're going to do it again, uh, when Kabam uh, puts out more content that targets four stars. They already have in variant uh, level difficulty um, the back issues. Um, I believe it was a uh, variant four. You had certain quests where you could not bring anything but four stars. And I'm pretty sure they're going to do that again. All right. Hopefully I didn't miss anyone already, but it's very, very possible. And uh, if I did miss you, I'm sorry. Uh, just leave a comment. And uh, eventually... Eventually, I will start recognizing and remembering your name, uh, especially if your name is different from uh, your YouTube name, then it's a little bit harder for me. But I do try to make the effort, especially if you uh, come by my streams often. Um, I try to make that effort to remember what your in-game name is and uh, look for it and recognize it. All right, so this arena um, is percentage-based, so a lot of people got this champion other than the top 200 that we're seeing here. So if you are one of those, feel free to leave a comment. Let me know. I read all the comments, so let me know what ranking you got and uh, what score you put up. All right. There we go. So that is the four star uh, basic. Let's take a look at the four star featured. Now, this one, he is an old champion, but some people may still not have gotten him. So I'm trying to look here to see. <laughs> I'm looking at some of these names. Uh, I'm trying to look here to see if I recognize any names because if they didn't have him as a four star, and they are a collector like me, the preacher, hmm. um, then they would have done that. I was looking at the preacher because uh, there was a preacher that created a family of alliances that I was a part of. I can't remember if that was his in-game name or not, uh, especially since... Um, you could change your name and, and all of that. So I'm not sure if that was him or not. Uh, the Integral, congratulations. So you didn't have a uh, 
uh, a four-star Falcon, huh? Okay. Good pickup. Good pickup. All right. Let's see if we see anybody else uh, that we recognize here. Um, definitely, if you haven't grabbed him, uh, I'm very curious to see what he uh, went for as a, a four-star. I'm sure he went pretty low. You know, um, like I said, with the rework, he is more useful than he was before. So I think he's worth having, even as a four star, if you're a collector or if you are still progressing. I think he would actually help you out a lot. If you need somebody to um, counter those auto evaders, then he's your guy. And he does a lot more damage, too, uh, than he did before. So definitely pick this guy up. Um, now, in this arena, we're seeing the top 200 like we do in all the arenas. Uh, but the top 800 actually get the champion. What? Big Blue? What you doing? I'm curious. Leave a comment. What you doing, Big Blue? Congratulations. Are you just maxing out his SIG? Big Blue has a huge roster, okay, guys? So when I see his name on, on this, and I know it's an older champion, he's either going for the dupe or he's very close to maxing um, the SIG on that uh, champion or something like that. All right. And that's going to be it. Now, to close out the video... We're going to take a look at the five star. This is the big one. And you can see this is the score that I usually put up for the 5,000 shards. So far, that has gotten me the shards. Um, especially when a champion is going to go low, that's a safe score. Uh, for champions that are more popular, I still put that up. So far, I have not missed. But if I do, I'll start putting up a little bit more. But 20 to 25 million is what I tell people uh, to put up to get the 5,000 five-star shards. People have gotten it with 20. Uh, if the champion goes really low, even 19 million. But for me, 20 to 25 seems to be the sweet spot. And so I usually just go 22. Okay. So far, so good. All right, let's take a look, see if we can uh, recognize anyone here. Ben Riley, congratulations, rank 17. Not bad, not bad at all. Very curious. Like I said, a lot of people already got this guy. Mark, congratulations, man. 24. Cool, cool. All right. Yeah, I think a lot of people, the integral again. Congratulations, picking them all up, ain't you? Okay, congratulations, man. Yeah, I, I think anyone that didn't have him or had him but didn't have him awakened, this would be a nice, uh, easy pickup for more developed rosters. Um, I already have him, and he's duped a few times at that. So there was no need for me to uh, go for him. All right. Now, um, Karate Mike, congratulations. I, I don't know him personally, but I definitely know him. He's a fellow YouTuber as well. Uh, he's in the CCP uh, along with me. Uh, so definitely uh, congratulations there, man. All right. Coat Hanger, congratulations. Coat Hanger may grind arena more than I do. Pretty sure she does. Uh, Black Gamer, congratulations. Okay, we got uh, several people. I think if you didn't have him or you just want him awakened, uh, this would have been a good time to do it. Uh, he is much better, as I've mentioned earlier. So I'm not surprised to see folks uh, picking him up for the low low. All right. Some of these names I've seen, but I don't know them personally. But I'm familiar with their names because they're often in the leaderboards, on the leaderboards, you know? All right. 
Now, a little nostalgia. 150 used to be the cutoff. Anyone that went below 150 didn't get the champion. But they changed it to the top 300 now. So everyone on this leaderboard got the champion plus another 100. All right, so let's keep on going. It used to be that Azalin or Azalin, you would have been close, but so far. All right, let's keep going. Everybody on this board got them. I do like that change. So far, um, it's kept the uh, cutoffs pretty low. Contest of Noobs, congratulations, man. That's a name I haven't seen in a little bit. All right. Let's see. We're getting down to the end. Samwise, really? Genji. Okay. Somebody loves that uh, Lord of the Rings. No problem. And that's it. So that's going to do it, guys, for this video. Hopefully you enjoyed the uh, leaderboard view here. If you got the champion, uh, leave a comment. Even if you didn't get the champion, what score did you put up that you missed? And what was your ranking? That might help some people uh, when they go for the champion next round. Or they may decide not to go for the champion if it's too high for them. But that's going to do it. Take care. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.